Hey guys, Vimal here and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be very interesting. So make sure to watch it till the end. Thing is, no matter how many TVs you have at your home, at some or the other point in your life, you would surely want to have a projector, guys. Because watching content on a projector or maybe playing games on a projector, nah, the whole experience is different. You'll feel like cinema at your home or, you know, you'll get that theater-like feel. And that is the reason people keep looking to buy like a good portable projector for your home. But see, let me tell you unless you have like a good 1080p resolution kind of projector now you won't get that feel and that is the reason i'm going to show you something nice in this video so today we have a brand new projector this is something new from van bo guys it's a flagship level t6 max projector and let me tell you it's a portable compact on the go projector that and the best part is it's like a true 1080p smart android projector and also has like built-in stereo speakers guys it's like fully loaded with tech and features and today in this video we're gonna unbox and check it out and along with that guys i'll be talking about all of its features and i'll be sharing like my complete experience on this thing so without wasting any more time let's get started Okay, so here's our new projector from Van Bo, came in this sort of box packaging and as I've told you at the beginning, this is their flagship model called as the T6 Max. Very simple packaging, you've got the Van Bo branding everywhere, a picture of the product on the front and that's it. So without wasting any more time, let's quickly get started with the unboxing. Let me grab my knife and cut this seal on the package. And oh, looks like there's one more box inside and this must be the actual projector box. Looks neat and class as you would expect. Okay, we've got the Mambo branding everywhere on it, a picture of the product on the front and some details mentioned. And by the way, it's available only in one color, which is white finishing. To the side, you've got some of its features mentioned. As I've told you, it's a true native 1080p Android projector, has electronic keystone correction, electronic focusing as well, built-in stereo speakers and runs on Android operating system. And let me tell you, it offers a certified Android TV-like experience. I'll tell you about all of these at a later part in the video and at the back side you've got some more details like it has a fully sealed light engine with low noise dual fans on the inside to keep it running cool. So those were some of the details guys and anyways let's quickly get started with the unboxing. There you go as soon as you open it we've got the projector at the top nicely packed like this. Wow, we'll just come back to this in a moment and along with that you get some paperwork, a remote control for the projector, Looks nice and also has a mic on board with Google Assistant function built in, a 95 watt adapter to power up the projector and a main squad for that. That's it, these are all the stuff we got in the package. Now let's finally check out the product that we've been waiting for. Ta-ta! -ta our first look at the Vambo T6 Max. Holy moly, that looks beautiful, right? Very unique design. It's a portable on-the-go 1080p Android projector and is not that heavy also. Weighs only around 1.95 kgs. On the front, you've got a high-quality glass lens with electronic focus mechanism and there's a grill below that must be for the speakers. And oh, I love these chrome trims on it. Gives a premium touch to the whole product. Going to the top side, there's only a power button over here. Overall build quality is very good, excellent finishing I can say. Body is entirely made of polycarbonate and also offers a leather-like strap on it so you can easily carry it anywhere. I like the matte finishing on the body, it doesn't attract fingerprints so that is one plus point. And at the back is where you've got all the connectivity ports. You've got two USB ports on it to connect some storage devices, a headphone jack is also there, AV out and a HDMI in is also there. Below that, there's a DC port to connect the adapter. The back of the body has lots of holes on it to keep it running cool and on the bottom, you've got some more stuff like some rubber foot pads on all the corners, a quarter inch thread at the center to fix it on a tripod and some details on the model. That's it, our complete overview on the design and the build quality part. So now what I'll do is I'll quickly set it up, use it for a couple of days and then I'll be back to continue the video. So guys, I'm back to continue the video. The projector is all set up and good to go. And right now we're in my bedroom in my home and I'm giving you a projector demo over here. As you can see, the projector is all set up and we're at the home page. And it's placed almost like six feet away from the wall and we're getting a projection size of almost like 85 inches. Uh, I know you might be not be able to see clearly because the lights in my room are turned on, but don't worry, I'll turn it off and I'll give you like a complete overview on that in a moment. Uh, and also I've seen that on the website, it can go almost up to like 120 or 150 inches also 
also in projection size but for that you'll have to place this projector even further away from the wall but see based on my experience now i felt this was like the best optimal distance guys considering it's a 550 ansi lumen projector if you take it further away now i felt the brightness of the image was getting reduced and you know things like that that's why i felt this was like the best optimal result i was getting anyways what i'll do is i'll quickly turn off the lights and i'll quickly give you like an overview on the ui built-in apps and features and then we'll talk about the picture quality Okay, there you go. This is how the home screen on Bamboo T6 Max looks like. And as I've told you, this projector runs on Android version 9 out of the box, guys. And also it's like certified Android TV experience, which is the same as you would see on an Android TV, guys. So on the home screen, you've got a couple of apps. You've got Play Store features mentioned and all that stuff. And at the top, you've got all your favorite quick section apps. And let me tell you, this thing comes with like built-in all your popular OTT streaming apps. Like you've got Amazon's Prime Video built-in. Netflix is also there. YouTube is also there. There and a couple of other apps as well and best part is since it's like certified android projector you also have like built-in google play store guys and all you need to do is just click on that and then you'll be able to download any app or game that you want to install and you know experience on this projector so that is also very nice and convenient uh, let's just go back home so what i'll do is i'll quickly you know head over to the settings and show you all the general settings available on it and one more thing i have to tell you guys the projector supports bluetooth version 5.0 that means you can easily connect any bluetooth you know headphones or even speakers and enjoy great audio quality or you do have built-in stereo speakers as well we'll check out the audio quality in a moment and apart from that it supports dual band wi-fi it supports both 2.4 g and 5 gigahertz network so that is one plus point so this is how the settings on it looks like and wait a second have i told you that uh, this projector has like electronic focus system that means you don't need to manually tune the focus on the projector there is no manual ring at all you just need to use this remote control guys using this remote control you've got two buttons over here uh, you just need to press it like this and there you go you can electronically focus the image on this projector guys very cool and also happens like quickly super awesome right now everything looks crisp and sharp right anyways in the settings you've got bluetooth options from here you can easily pair things like maybe uh, bluetooth audio devices or maybe like bluetooth game pads and stuff like that you've got a mouse mode also and you've got input source select it does have an hdmi input right you can even connect anything like maybe your fire tv stick or maybe any sort of tv sticks or you can even connect any external devices like maybe your pc also and experience pc gaming on this projector guys that is awesome and you've got a couple of video options as well uh, in the projection mode guys you can change the uh, projection style for example if you are viewing it from upside down direction some people fix the projector top side down right you can adjust it like that and you know you've got a couple of options over here it also supports 4d keystone correction guys and that to automatic keystone is also there so it'll automatically adjust the keystones no matter where you project it on any wall surface so that is also one nice thing and best part is this projector also has like sidewards projection support guys i'll show you the demo of that at a later part in the video once we are done with the whole software and feature stuff going down you got a zoom function aspect ratio select sound is also there you can adjust the sound and volume and these sort of stuff and basically all the android general settings are easily available on this and one more thing i have to mention is as soon as i turned on the device i got a couple of software updates also so you do keep getting them frequently and coming to the storage section have i told you that it's got like 16 gb storage on board and out of that 9 gb is available guys rest of them is occupied by operating system and you know other built-in ott apps and stuff like that that's it these are all the general settings and you know software information and stuff now if you ask about the whole ui and the experience well see i've been using this projector for almost like a couple of days and so far i haven't faced any sort of lag or stutters guys while navigating through the ui i mean look at it everything is happening so smoothly no matter what app you open everything is like super smooth guys overall user experience is nice i didn't face any sorts of lags or stutters during my usage You've got a couple of more apps in this section let me show you that also like you've got google play store hulu and also iMirror is also there basically guys it supports casting as well so you can even cast your mobile phone screen onto the projector and view that stuff also so what i'll do is i'll quickly open up youtube play some video on it so i'll get to experience like how the picture quality is and the audio quality of the built-in speakers just check out this clip Whoa, I've been waiting for this guy, so it's finally arrived today. So every time I try to bring and show you something or the other new text. 
stuff on the channel right and today's video is also gonna be like super awesome and is definitely gonna blow your mind hey guys Vimal here and welcome back to my channel so this what I have over here is like a complete custom themed PC accessory that's gonna take your gaming PC to the next level guys so remember last time I showed you how to add like a tiny display to your PC and use it like a sensor panel so it's something similar to that only and I found it on a similar website only guys called Mac DIY. These guys make like crazy PC accessories so make sure to check out their website. Okay, you guys saw the image quality right? What do you think? Let me know in the comment section down below. See if you would ask me picture quality on this projector is quite impressive for this price point all thanks to it being a true 1080p projector guys it's got native 1080p resolution and because of that there is like good amount of detail even if you go almost like 100 or 120 inches projection size everything is clearly visible and all the text is also easily readable just look at that video sample over there but one thing i do have to mention is see the image was losing a bit of sharpness at the edges that is what i felt guys uh, the sharpness was like very good at the center and almost up to like 70% radial area but as you go to the extreme corners right I felt the image was losing a bit of sharpness over there but apart from that everything else was great if you talk about the colors colors were also very good guys rich and vibrant everything looks so nice on this projector much better than a lot of other models that I've reviewed even up to like 20 25,000 so this is one of the best I could say and apart from that guys if you ask about the white balance and you know the dynamic range everything was nice but but unfortunately the brand has not provided any sort of image adjustment options in the settings as there's nothing you can do you just have to you know accept whatever is given so I felt you know if the brand could have given options to adjust the brightness or maybe like adjust the colors that would have been like awesome anyways apart from that I am like very satisfied with the overall picture quality on this projector and talking about the sound, I've told you, right, the projector comes with like stereo speakers, each of 5 watts. So you can get around like 10 watts of output and audio quality was also actually quite good, guys. I felt it was just like a Bluetooth speaker only, like quality was pretty comparable to that. There was good clarity with minimum distortion and output also quite loud and satisfactory. Actually, like more than sufficient for a bedroom, guys. But see, if you're looking for something like a more cinematic and theater-like feel, then I would advise you to connect something like an external sound bar or maybe like a 5 point one home theater setup that would definitely take the experience to a next level but apart from that for a regular home purpose now the built-in speakers are like more than enough you'll be quite happy with the results well that's it for today that was our video on vanbo's new t6 max it's a very good projector love the design form factor native 1080p resolution and also supports video playback up to 4k so you'll have a great time watching content on youtube or any other ott platform like maybe netflix or amazon prime video and since it's got android tv os running on board that makes things even more convenient for you but here are a couple of things you'll have to keep in mind while using the product if you want best results I'd advise you to use it in total darkness during night time or in a dark room otherwise image won't be that visible so keep that in mind. Second is if you're watching the content in low volume you can surely hear the fan noise from the projector that is because it has like dual fans on board to keep it running cool so that can be a bit annoying sometimes and lastly I wish it had some picture or image quality adjustment in the settings you can't even adjust the brightness on this thing. Well, apart from that, everything else was great. The T6 Max costs around like 29,000 rupees in India. I'll just leave a link to that in the description box below. You can check it out there. So that's it for today. I hope you all had a great time watching the video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more awesome videos. And I'll see you all in my next one.